action taken by council is null and void and Carol Augustine remains a member of the West Catanning Municipal Water Authority Board for the 7th day of April, 2014. West Catanning Borough Council. motion. I have a question first. Good. Are we able to um, appoint another board member on the Water Board Authority? Like, would there be a reason why we could not appoint another board member? Only if there's a vacancy. Right. So there's only allotted so many board seats. member seats. I think so. I just had a question. I wasn't here when that happened, and I want to know why we would appoint somebody that doesn't have the knowledge when Rick Cogley has the knowledge of where everything, where the water lines are. He's the knowledge of um, the streets. He's an educated man. I'm just curious of how that all got upset. The vote didn't go that way. That's all I can say. I mean, you put somebody in there that that knows the knowledge and has the knowledge. Yeah, that's it's just a shame. And actually, I think that I, I, I think that uh, Bruce Elfro said it the best. This is the first time in the history of the water board that the person they recommended didn't get. Uh, I mean, that, that's all you can say. That, Motion. How did that happen? So, anyhow, I make a motion to accept the resolution as it states. Second. All those in favor? Is there a permanent record? I can write it down and log it in or something. 
Okay. Yeah, just so for future references yeah. for, you know. For well, if somebody comes up with some suggestion that we're not maintaining the streets that you have or if we did do a bunch of right. storms or storm drains, because there's right. going to be a lot more collapsing and it's not like we can't take care of it. Yeah, it seems like there. it's happening that we need to take care of it. It would be nice to have a law book for, for that so you know. We'll, we'll see whenever I was working there, we wrote everything down, what we did, you know, mm -hmm. we kept it. Is it still up there? I think they, I think those guys got rid of it. Who's Who did? those guys? I think Bernie and those guys got rid of it. Yeah, but I have not You don't know that for sure, though. Yeah, Who got there, rid of it? There was not, though. It wasn't me. Well, that, like I said, it's just weird. I think Paul is heading in the direction that we want to maintain the streets. And I mean, we're we we committing here. We don't start. want to forget that we did the job. Exactly. You know? Do you I need some? Do you board. need some log books that we can have? Currently, order some log books. I like to see we're working on everything up there. Okay. Yeah. History. And all the locations and all right. the dates of when anything was replaced. You can get inserts like this, and you can put the bills in it. You know, if you pay and leave for your plates or whatever, you make a copy of the receipts. You have the place. No, they do keep copies of a lot of stuff. Oh, yeah. One more question about the streets. Uh, mm -hmm. we, have a, we have a truck up there, right? I mean, the president, as Nesky said, I have a letter in on it, uh, where I have a letter probably this week. Where's council's opinion on where that should go? I mean, do we, do we want to drive it where I gravel? Do we want to keep it until next year in winter? I mean, is it just maintain? No, no, they're driving. Okay. Well, I just was curious. I mean, I mean, do we want to save it for next winter? Or do we put it in the county? But I mean, I was under the impression where we can't drive it. No. No, they're driving. Yeah, the only thing I had them to bring in a load of stone, wine tongue, and I told them, like, there, one of you know, once you take, like, eight times away from amusement, then you use the white truck and go get it. In your opinion, everybody that's coming here should be used as regular service truck. Okay. Is that your opinion? I think it should be. I mean, that's that's the only way you find out. We got a warning on it, and if you don't use it when you're doing when the warning is, I mean, how are you going to make things It's not good what other people said. I don't know. So that's I said. I mean, we don't want to go out there and walk a full drive and start ripping stumps out. But I mean, we definitely need to go out and maintain it, get it warmed up, start the drive, use it until the summertime. And again. After you get the lettering on, are you going to have a newspaper take a picture of it? That's up to you guys. You want to write an article? I don't think you guys are probably worried about taking a picture, but if you want to, come out and write an article. Why don't you do that in conjunction with the open house? Yeah, we can put that right there. That's a good idea. Is that fair what you said? Yeah. Yeah, that's a good idea. Because it's going to be coming at the same time. Everything's going to be coming together at the same time, so we can pull it out front and have a part of the other. One, one thing I want to add, the street department. I'm glad to see that you know our, our workers now, our street department workers, uh, are uh, doing a lot of work here in the borough that before was being... I guess you want to say contracted out, which shouldn't have been. And it's costing money to borrow. To borrow money. For instance, just the whole up to Pine Hill, you know, uh, they went up and fixed that. They, you know, I know they saved the borrow money by doing it. Because in the past, it would have been actually contracted out to somebody to do it. a waste of money. But I, I appreciate the work they did. They do good work, and, and I, I don't see any problem handling putting the uh, uh, pipe in down along Southern Avenue. Yeah, you got the equipment to do it. And that pipe, that pipe's in bad shape. Uh -huh. And it's then, bad shape for a long, long and then time. at the end of the pipe, they dug it out and put blacktop in it, so when it comes down. It, jumps up out. Yeah. It doesn't even go down. That needs cleaned out. Yeah. Right. And then down at, at the stop sign, that pipe's collapsing. You put blacktop on it. 
and that's just going to make it worse. Well, it sounds like we're on the right track getting that yeah. taken care of. And like I said, Karen, uh, the reason why I have to make the pain is because she probably walks past every day. She <laughs> probably just shakes her head. Five today. <laughs> so. Yeah, I, I told Bernie about that a couple yeah. years ago. It was yeah. 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 I still have stuff to do with today.
All right, I need a motion to pay two crew for phase three for $2,547.50. I have a motion. Second. All those in favor? And second. And second. Why is 10% off the hotel from those bills? That was, the, that was the remainder of all three phases. So two crew is done. Like I said, the fourth and final phase <clears throat> is the doors. I think at this point we'll probably get a machine. Okay. Yeah. Um, we'll talk to them when we get up there. But again, we have to meet with him as a, as a whole. So um, but that's a phase four future thing. Right. And I have I do have phase four here. But uh, it's it's just relevant. I mean, we can, you know, as um, my colleagues suggested, I mean, we can probably buy. Any other new business? Yes. Jim.
I am in the process of looking at the old reports. We had talked about it like two weeks ago. Mm -hmm. And um, I am in the process of looking at the old words, which I do have somewhere around here. And I have I have a uh, copy of a uh, ordinance that has a lot better eyes in it. We're going to try to compare the two, put some, you know, mix and match. I think by the next meeting, we'll probably have Which you do? Just off of the website. Yeah, I got some. Right. Yeah, sit down and get together and look at it. What I, what I want to do is just compare the two and then write in what we need in the orders that we have mm -hmm. and get out what we don't need and get what we have. So we'll have to have a second. Yeah, it's very kind of good. And I mean, we have to get, and we'll have to get the solution. But it's not. Right. But yeah. So you're going to rewrite the order? Yeah. We'll rewrite the order. Yeah. 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 Because I, I agree with I agree with everybody. Else. Oh, right. there's, there's so many people doing it, and, and they shouldn't be doing it. They shouldn't burn, you know, things that shouldn't burn yeah. other right? yeah. barrel materials, stuff like that. There, what people do every day, I don't know why they should be fine. But with the ordinance we have right now, I don't know. It doesn't prevent a lot of it. And, and, and the hours to burn, you, 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 most of the guys do it to get rid of stuff. So they burn it in the afternoon. Well, yeah, the ordinance says from noon to seven. So <laughs> they're actually burning liquid. Yeah, I, uh, yeah. I, I thought we had an ordinance on recreational. That's just word of mouth. That's it does say it's an informal you know, decision that was no, made. I thought, we had, fires I thought we had an ordinance. There is an ordinance. It, it is. It, it is. says it, recreational fire it does. 12 or 18 fire. inches yeah. right. it in a range. Right, a two-foot ring or something like that there, but it doesn't stay the material is not burnt. I mean, we gotta get, we got to get the hours changed. Yes, yeah, it has to be put yeah. up by 8 o'clock or something like that. Because I mean, everybody here, yeah. distance from buildings. Yeah, I mean, that's yeah. in the open. This is in the open. And that's probably a lot of these. I got one other thing. Captain Gehagen, you said something about a computer and a system. Yeah, we'd like to address that now. We're going to start the meeting. We're going to meet with everybody in the plant. Pardon me? Do you, want, do you want to address it now, or you want to wait for the meeting? The computer systems that we have now operate under an XP system, the processing system order, and everything as far as state and federal government mandated reporting system goes under a Windows 7 and or above. At this point in time, we you know would need to update operating systems there so we can get compliance to send the information uh, to the federal government and the state government with regard to our criminal history stuff, our UCR reporting systems. So, what's the what cost to update this system? Honestly, you still don't have a choice because SP with Microsoft, <coughs> they're done. There's no more yeah. They're not as It costs 100 bucks to update a computer. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be dependent upon whether the system that we have currently will accept the new updates. Some of our computers are fairly old, so. At that point in time, we'd have to address whatever. If we can go ahead and do an update on them and they'll be current and operational, that's fine. If not, we'd have to address, you know, the purchase of different types of computer systems that would support the system at their request. I honestly, I hope you guys support new computer systems for them. Because if it was an XP when they had it on there, so they're way out there. Does this, ha how, does this have to be done now? Um, it, this will all be completed by the end of May. In the May. <laughs> now, the beginning of June, they're, they're no longer accepting the operational systems under XP. Yeah. Now, well, all of our computers, we have to take them, or can somebody come in and do the work here? Um, we would use the, you know, the county certified guys to go ahead and take care of it, because they're you know, set up to go ahead and do that to get into our operational systems. They have our VPN information to be able to do something with it. So at that point in time, you know, that's, that's who we can contact. But I just wanted to go ahead and make you aware of what was going on. So that at that point, we can go ahead and address whatever issues come up and check the them and see first, you know, if they can accept that system. Is this well, something you can, that you can do or is there something that the council has, has to do? Sorry? Is this something that you you're going to take care of, or is yes, this something you're going to take care of? With regard to having them stop up and take a look at it, make sure all our systems will accept it. If they can, then all we'd have to do is purchase the you know 
a Windows 7 system or something that we could operate off of at that point and have it installed. So, you know, and then they would check the operational value, make sure that everything's connected with the county and the, the state and federal government. I know, so they're secure and everything is done the way it's supposed to. We have, you know, our systems are all set up on a, on a sonic wall. So outside activity can't be penetrated into the system because that has, uh, you know, state repository records, mm -hmm. you know, the federal repository records. So we can't go outside the system. I had a question for you, Paul. Yes, sir. If you buy a brand new computer, does that solve your problem? Uh, we were able to get one brand new computer uh, through the grant program. Uh, we uh, received that from Haven. But I'm we saying we would, update the, we would update the computer. Not to interrupt you, I'm sorry. No, that, that one will have an operational system that will be capable of doing something. Well, what I'm saying is if you, update your, if you update to a newer computer, yeah, you could just download it off the websites. Yeah, we're... Because they won't, you, they won't be going into the Windows XP, is what you're saying. I don't, I don't understand your question, sir. The question is, we update the computer, the computer, buy a brand new computer, you can put the stuff on your... On yes, list. We, we'd have to have it transferred over, and we'd have to register that IP. Um, that would solve the problem. Yeah. We'd have to register the IP for the new computer, so it's identified through, you know, as soon as you type in, it identifies it through the state and federal government, says, hey, you know, yes, we can secure this particular you're going to see if your existing machines yes. can be updated before you Yeah, we were just going to get hold of uh, folks that came up and did the work for before. Uh, they worked through the county system. So they'll be able to get in with the current, you know, the sonic will be at the end through the county so we can check and see if we can get everything taken care of and see what the, you know, least costly way of being able to take care of it's going to be. How old is your system? How old is it here? Uh, off the top. Probably the the one that was there. When we talk. 2000. We received yeah. one in 2009, but it was through NDOT, uh, through the crash reporting system, and it was, you know, it was previously held by PANDOT. Yeah, so I don't know how old that particular computer is. It's probably back in the early 2000s. You know, it's just XP is pretty much Microsoft doesn't support it anymore. So if they're not going to support it, state federal government's not going to support the system that that's no longer supported. Can we have a police committee meeting on this after this meeting, and then we can go over that and discuss that? That's up to you. Okay. I don't know if I got to about this particular meeting. I got No, no, not tonight. Not tonight. Coming up, and after he checks some situation, figures it out, lets us know what's going on, then we can see which way we want to go either get new computers or time on the Yeah, like, like that, the end of the day. Mm -hmm. Once we get it up, we want to get an idea. Yeah. We should be able yeah. to get a pricing right away and so forth. So, you know, that shouldn't be you know, a long process to go ahead and go through. I, I was aware of that computer being over 10 years, so. Is it just better off if we go ahead and just get new computers? Yeah. Yep. Just, it is. is it just something that we should just go ahead and get new computers and just be done with That's it? That's possible. We can look at grants for that, too. Well, we, we made an application <laughs> on the uh, grant that's coming up. Sam's I discussed with the mayor, and, no, it's not but unfortunately, that grant may not come through in time to make the change. Okay. We'll get with you both. Okay. Pause. I should have brought this up in the finished business, but I forgot. We were going to advertise <coughs> for people to serve on the zoning committee. Yes. Carly got mixed up. She didn't advertise. So we're going to have to wait till next meeting. To <coughs> next meeting to get it done. And we're also going to advertise for people to. Uh, Serve on the police committee to investigate. We didn't do that either, so we didn't get that done. Okay, as long as I can know when to put in and when. I didn't work. Yeah, but if you wrote, uh, emailed me, uh, well, I'll get to it. I'll be up. Okay. I'll be up Thursday, sign checks. Okay. And May 5th is open. What's that? May 5th is open. May 5th is open. Mm -hmm. I didn't miss that as well. 
Did you have something to make? I'm going to thank you for the money for the honor roll. I do think that the building of the meeting probably will be done by May. I think we're going to have time reporting that to be decided. Well, that's the May 5th is memorial for down here. Is that what you were saying? No, no. no May 5th is open for your next meeting. Oh, oh, okay. Next meeting here. Okay. All right. Any other new business? All right. Motion to pay the bills. I like I looked at them online. I appreciate you sending them to me. Yeah. With that being said, Carly, I think you're doing an amazing job. I do too. You keep us all yeah. informed. I appreciate all the emails. You have been awesome. We've, I've never been informed like I have been. No, and even the, even the updates that come through, the community, you put them, I've looked at more stuff online than you did the secretary and I I mean, you get your minutes, you get your bills. We are informed very well. Thank you. So I'll make a motion to the bill. I have one question. question. Was your emergency order for salt on this bill? I thought it was on the one yeah. Yeah. Last one. Okay. All right. There are salt. Yeah, more salt. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. All right. Thank you. I make a motion. Second. Oh, you are. Oh, I have a second. All the same team. All those in favor? Need a uh, motion for adjournment? I will make a motion for that. All those in favor? Second. In favor? Oh, I want to. It's all right. Yes. Oh, they're horrible. Look at a pillow next time.